We're going to have a look at how you can add a video intro when you set a to-do. The videos could be ones you've made and uploaded to Purple Mash, or ones you've made and uploaded to or found on another hosting service such as YouTube, Loom or Vimeo. In Purple Mash we're going to create an All About leaflet in To Publish. I'm going to click on All About and select the Set To Do option. Start setting the to-do as normal, adding in the title and the description. And then if you've copied a link from YouTube or another streaming service, you simply paste it into the box. Often streaming services have embed codes next to their video. In YouTube you click on a share button and then choose embed code and then you can copy it. If this is the case, you can copy that and then when you go back into Purple Mash, you can paste this embed code into the description. You can add in the audio instructions, the objectives or the tags and then click on next and set dates if you'd like to and then select your class pupils or groups. In the to-dos area, if you pasted a link, there'll be a clickable link in the to-do. And if you embedded a video, there'll be a playable video in the to-do. If you're embedding videos from YouTube, what you could find is when you press pause or get to the end, suggestions for more videos come up. These are determined by YouTube and have nothing to do with Purple Mash. There are steps you can take to control what you see here. I'm going to click on edit for this to do and scroll down to look at the iframe. Within the iframe I can pick out the URL for that video that I copied from YouTube. At the end of that, if I type a question mark in and then rel equals zero, with that alteration to the iframe, what we find is if we play and then we pause or get to the end of the video, if there are any more videos suggested, they come from the same channel as the embedded video. This means that if you've got a YouTube channel just for your teaching videos, any videos that might be suggested will be just other videos from that channel rather than videos from across YouTube. We're now going to go to the work folder to have a look at uploading a file we've made ourselves. We absolutely must put the videos we've made into a shared class folder so the children have got permissions to view them. In my dolphins folder I'm going to create a new folder called intro videos. This is where I'm going to upload the videos I've made. I simply click on it and click on upload and select the file I wish to upload. I've now uploaded the trees video that I showed you earlier. Once it's uploaded, I can click on it to open it. And when I've opened it, I can then copy the URL at the top of the screen. I can then paste that URL into the description area of the to-do and then set the to-do in the same way as I did a moment ago. I'm now in Purple Mash as Alfie, who's part of Dolphin's class. Alfie has clicked on his to-dos and can see he's got a to-do with a video in it. He can click on play and watch the video inside the to-do. Once he's finished watching the video, he can click on start and undertake the activity. If Alfie's been set a to-do with a video link rather than an embedded video, Alfie can click on the link to watch the video. He can watch the video, which opens in another tab. And then he can click back to Purple Mash and click on start to complete the task. Here I've got two documents for my maths lesson. I'm going to click on the intro video and copy the URL. I'm then going to click on the PDF and click on set to do. When I enter the description, I can paste the URL for the video. The rest is the same. I set this for Dolphin's class and then set the to do. From the to do here, you see the children watch the video and then download the worksheet. Don't forget that you can also use the full picture templates in To Publish to add your worksheet in if you've saved it as an image file. Then children can write over it in text boxes and add markup using the paint tools. Go to Menu and Share to save and set it as a to-do when you've set it up. Search YouTube for Purple Mash and PDF to find out more.